Hi, my name's Bob Grignard and I'm a volunteer with the Martin Fleischmann Memorial Project. So what I'm showing you here is what I have been doing since early February uh, with the family's masks. And we have a hot radiator here. And on it, uh, when we've used the masks, uh, we come indoors, we take it off from our ears back and we place it on the radiator. And the heat, elevated heat, uh, accelerates uh, the potential uh, destruction of any virus particles on there. Okay, so uh, this is my son's mask with this wonderful skull and crossbones. There's a good uh, sense of humour there. Uh, and my wife and uh, daughter's mask. And uh, other masks which are disposable are these ones. And then um, I have this salt-treated mask. And I've done a tutorial on how to salt-treat a mask. And this is the one that I use if I go into the supermarket uh, uh, going shopping in, or in an enclosed space for shorter periods of time. And I've been using this uh, quite successfully for uh, probably three weeks now, and the salt is still in place. I'll probably do a microscopic uh, analysis of this to see uh, the crystals that are there. Um, so I use that for shopping, and then if I'm going in an enclosed space, which is very rare for a long period of time, I'll use this uh, respirator, of which I have a number that I use in rotation. Actually, I rarely need to use this because really all I need to do is either be outside and we have very good social distancing here in the Czech Republic or the occasional times when I'm going to the supermarket to do a big shop. So there it is, uh, using heat to kill the virus sooner on our masks. Thank you very much for your time. I'll see you in the next video.